BJ. Back in the building. Back in effect. <laughs> back like we never left. Absolutely, man. Appreciate you for <laughs> hey, appreciate you. Nah, for that. I when you leave me hanging. Yeah, you was quick, you was quick, you was quick to the draw on that. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with it. Uh but we appreciate y'all for pulling up with us right now. Uh we're gonna be jumping into the band and the staples. The yeah. title of this song uh is The Weight. Yeah. yeah. And it's not spelled like hold on the weight. We're like weight in, as in pounds, so I don't hold know. Hold up, wait a minute. So not that way. There, there might be like some type of like <laughs> double meaning in regards to the title of the song, like the weight. Okay. Not like the weight, like hold on, like the weight is on my shoulders. Okay. Um, shout out to Kimberly Jenkins also for this recommendation. Okay, mm -hmm. this is a song via donation. Absolutely. So thank you so much, Kimberly, for supporting the channel for sure. Okay. Um, <clears throat> all right. If you haven't already, be sure you head over to my blog channel. I'm just Asia, y'all. Tap into the content. I also have a reaction channel. I'm still Asia, dropping fire reactions, y'all. The links will be in the description for both of those channels, so make sure y'all check them out. And if y'all are watching right now, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos from Asia and BJ. And y'all, let's go ahead and jump into the band and the staples, The Wait. Yeah. Let's go ahead and get into this video, y'all. All right. You ready? Hmm? All right. <laughs> Starting out like that. I pulled into Nazareth, just feeling about half past dead. Just need to find a place where I can lay my head. Mister, can you tell me where a man might find a bed? He just grinned and shook my hand. No, was all he said. <laughs> Yes. Take a load to free. Take a load off Fanny. And you put the load right on, on me. Right on me. I picked up my bags oh. and went looking for a place to hide. When I saw old Carmen and the devil walking side by side. Come on. And I said, hey, Carmen, come on, let's go downtown. She said, I gotta go, but my friend can stick around. Take a load off Fanny. Take a load for free. Yeah. Just old Luke and Luke is waiting on the judgment day. Hey, Luke, my friend, what about a young Anna Lee? He said, Do me a favor, son, or won't you stay and keep an Anna Lee company? Oh. Yeah. Ooh, I love this song a lot. Mm -hmm. This is actually one of my one of my dad's songs that he used to play a lot. Oh, did he? To, yeah, like the Staples and the Staples singles and stuff yeah. like that. Like, he has a lot of, like, their records, the Staples. Uh, but, yeah, the band, like, this particular song, The Weight, like, this, hey, this is an excellent, excellent, excellent Absolutely. song. Classic. You Everything know what I mean? Everything about this, especially, like, I, I love, like, the intimacy in, in, in terms of, like, the 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 acoustic feel that he kind of gives. It's not like yeah. an acoustic song because somebody's back there. You got the guitar. You got somebody on the drums and stuff like that. But, they strip it down you know, to a it's degree. very stripped. It's very raw. You getting pure vocals out of this, like, but between the two of them, like, I was kind of surprised that the drummer <laughs> started singing. But mm -hmm. I was like, yeah, like, yeah. I love like seeing. And, and, and I can't recall. I think we did a, a, a reaction by the band and maybe a live before where he was playing and singing, and singing at the same too. Time. Yeah. That's that's okay. Because mm -hmm. I was gonna say I only, I feel like I've only seen that one other time. But mm -hmm. I, yeah, okay, that yeah. was okay. That would make sense. Yeah, and, and this song was, like I said, my dad loves the band. He loved, mm. like, the Staples, sing the Staples Singers. Yeah. Uh, but I believe this was written by Bobby or Robbie Robertson. 
something like that. Yeah. One of the band members. Okay. Okay. It sounds great though. Exactly. I, I that's why. Man. That's why mm-hmm. before the song started, I was like, uh, you know, this song is about the weight, not like hold on, wait, but the like the weight. Yeah, you know, I feel like, like the those weight opportunities or something. don't don't really come very often. Though is all I'm saying. Like especially for anybody, I feel like you don't have anybody to come and just take take off your issues, like whatever it is you got going on. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? And just and just be like, don't worry about it. I I got it this time. Take you know the weight off, exactly. And, and not looking for something back in return. It, it, it almost reminds you of like some of the stories in the Bible, like Bethlehem and going to Nazareth, things like that. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if this has anything, like any religious terms, but it's really just uh, what you said right there in regards yeah. to just like alleviating the weight from somebody else's soldiers mm-hmm. and, and, and taking that on from somebody, yeah. you know? Like this song has obviously I feel I just feel like it has a deeper meaning you know at the end of the day you know and it, just in regards to like if you see someone that's kind of going through something it's like you know you, and, and you really care for them you'll do whatever you can do to kind of alleviate 
the weight on their shoulders, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Kind of like what, what you were saying a minute ago. Yeah. You know? Uh, but I, I enjoy this one a lot in regards to them. I just wonder what, what Bobby was, was like, what, what, who was he referring to when he said, like, Fanny? Like, like who is he referring to? Is he, like, talking in regards to, like, an actual account, like, from an actual story or something that's that's happened? Like, like I just want to get deeper into, like, the, the, the actual songwriting of the song. Like, just like better understanding as far as like like who he who he was directing it to is there like a story behind the lyrics like that that's what I want to know you know what I mean babe you always you always be trying to talk about the story of the lyrics I'm trying to get deep into it but, I, I because this like is the, one of those songs that is like for that. itself like the song is self explanatory mm-hmm. it, it can be relatable to a lot of people in a lot of different ways like I said it, it it doesn't matter what the situation particularly might be like it's different for everybody to relate to this but in a way it's it's that, you know, help each other out. Give a hand with somebody when you can. And don't look for anything in return every time you offer yourself to help somebody out. That's, like, good. That's a good point. You know, I, I, obviously, <laughs> there, there are limitations to that. But I'm just saying, when you have the chance, like... You know, and that's that's kind of like, you know, how we were watching a, another video just the other day where it's just like, when you get so much of something, you know... Help those that that can't help themselves. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying, and do something good with that. Mm-hmm. I mean, if you're capable, I'm just like you. You're a fully capable body, able body of a, of a person to physically go out and help somebody. Then then do that. You know what I mean? When yeah. you have the opportunity to do so, you know, because you never know. Like that that could be taken away from you at any point. Mm-hmm. You know, and you and and then you don't even have that to offer. So you know, offer your love, offer your help, offer your your knowledge, your wisdom, your power, like. You know, whatever it is that you have to offer to people and don't expect the same in return because nine times out of ten, you're not going to get it. You're going to be disappointed that you don't get it. But if you don't look for it, that's when you'll get your biggest blessings. So, you know, that's just me. Yeah. But again, like I said, (laughs) I, I, I I just be in regards to just like, you know, what he was writing about, like Nazareth. I just wanted to know exactly kind of like what he was like touching on in regards to that, yeah. you know? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't really understand what he was saying about Nazareth. So I'm just like, kind of like, yeah, deep, you know, just try to dig a little bit more into that though. Yeah. But, uh, but yeah, definitely in regards to what you said, but I, I just really, really like what they're saying. It almost kind of took me back to like the old Southern hymns and things of that nature that people sing in church and things mm-hmm. like that. Like it had that kind of vibe to, to it in regards to, like you said, just like. Uh, being there for other people, yeah. you know, the weight, you know, the weight doesn't have to always be on your shoulders and somebody can always be there to alleviate that, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Other than that, I enjoyed this. <clears throat> yep, me too. Overall, mm-hmm. definitely enjoyed this. So, if y'all enjoyed this video, be sure you give us a big thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos from Asia and BJ. And if ain't nobody told you, I love you. And we're going to see y'all in the next video, y'all. Absolutely. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Dust in your body